a heart defect and not even know it? Sometimes you can go your whole life without incident. In other instances, it could be deadly. Shelly Botov introduces us to one local woman who's lucky her defect was caught before it caused damage. 27-year-old Megan Munzenmeyer had no idea she had a congenital heart defect that could be deadly. She says she feels lucky she listened to her body's warning signs and to her doctor at Aurora Bay Care Medical Center. Megan Munzenmeyer has always been active, but then suddenly two years ago she was having heart palpitations and was tired all the time. From everyday activity, I mean like going up a few steps. I couldn't walk and like hold a conversation at the same time. So Megan's doctor ordered an echocardiogram, which found a problem. It's called an atrial septal defect, which is just a hole between the two upper chambers. Megan had no idea she was born with a hole in her heart. I mean, I played softball, I played basketball. I mean, you're running, and I wasn't like the fastest kid on the court, but it wasn't. It never even crossed my mind. Dr. Matthew Schmidt, an interventional cardiologist at Aurora Bay Care Medical Center, says if the condition is left untreated, elevated blood pressure in the lungs, and eventually heart failure. There are two ways to fix the hole with open heart surgery, and then the chest, and it's a huge surgery. I mean, it carries a fair amount of risk. And includes days in the hospital and a long recovery. Dr. Schmidt chose a minimally invasive method where he snaked a catheter through a vein in the groin into the heart. He then plugs the hole with an Amplatzer septal occluder. It's just two discs. They, uh, they sit over the hole and close it up. The hole in the groin is small, you know, the size of a pinhead and there's no cutting involved. Megan went home the next day. I got a new lease on life at this point, even though I didn't know before. Today, things are a lot different for this mother of an active toddler. I could do things like in spurts, you know, but I would just, I would be tired. You know, I would just want to sit, but now I can keep up with them. Less than 1% of the population has an atrial septal defect, but it can cause problems at any age. The symptoms include heart palpitations, shortness of breath, and swelling in the legs. To learn more, you can call Aurora Bay Care or email healthwatch at auroraybaycare.com. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelly Botot, Local 5 News HD. Thank you, Shelly. 3D printers are now used to make all kinds of things, including firearms and replacement body parts. The advantages of 3D knees tomorrow in Health Watch. Local 5's Brooke Griffin joins us now.